Okay, so the last video is about getting help, and this is one thing that uh, that you really want to utilize if you're struggling in the course. You really want to follow this, what I'm going to mention in this video. Uh, if you need assistance after you have read the material in the textbook and watched any videos provided in the course, so make sure you try to study up before um, and do all you can that's provided in the course before you reach out to me. But um, I'm more than happy to help you. Um, so reach out to your instructor, which is me. Um, for further details, please watch the Getting Help video. Yeah, this, it's this video. Um, so let's uh, kind of just collapse all this. So you'll notice in blue, Getting Help Discussions. Um, this is where I will be posting um, the, the responses to you guys um, if you ask me any questions. So um, if you have a question from week one, I will answer your questions in week one uh, in this forum. So find your answers in here. Uh, so how you ask me questions, this is this is really crucial. Um, how you ask me questions, and uh, this primarily applies to the My Open Math assignments. So if you have a, uh, if you go into a homework 4.1 and you don't know, know how to do this problem, you hit message instructor about this question. And um, what's really nice is it'll email me um, the, in the subject line the problem you're working on and um, and you can provide any details and say, I don't understand this part. I don't understand how to do this problem. Any details of, of the problem, you, you, you know, there, there may be multiple parts of the problem. Uh, some problems have multiple parts. Make sure you, you specify what part you're struggling with or, you, you know, it might be everything. But uh, just so I know how to help you. Uh, the more detail, the better. Um, so... And then it'll email me, and then I will make a video, um, kind of like this, and um, I can help you. Uh, I'll work it out. I can, you know, write out problems. Um, I have a, a writing tablet that I can write out problems right on the screen like this, and work through problems. And um, and I also have a virtual T eighty three calculator, so I can show you how to use your calculator. Um, and I can make videos if, if applicable. Maybe I, a video isn't wouldn't be helpful, but. Um, I'll just uh, answer your questions, and I'll always answer your questions um, so I can help other students in the Getting Help Discussions forum, so depending on which activity. So notice that some weeks have multiple uh, assignments. So for example, week one has a, a, you know, a few assignments, so homework 4.1, homework 4.2. So what I'll probably do is I'll just say, if it's like problem one from 4.1, I'll add new thread and I'll just type in, um, you know, homework 4.1 and then number and then whatever. And then if it's multiple parts, I might say number one, part D or something like that. So the subject will tell you which, uh, um, uh, you know, what what I'm addressing. So if any students have, uh, have any questions, please uh, check in here and, um, uh, before you ask me any questions, because I may I may have already answered any uh, a question because um, the student may have already asked that question already. So go ahead and check here before you ask the your instructor, like I showed you. And um, so that's just the general process. It, it it worked really well before, and I'm going to stick with this process. Um, I, I I really want to see a lot of interaction. Please do not hesitate to reach out to me, but please check the videos and the textbook before you reach out to me. Don't just Go jump directly into the assignment right at the beginning of the week and just start asking questions without reviewing the material first. So, um, yeah, it, th this is just like a regular sort of discussion where you can ask questions too. Um, so keep in mind that um, that this is a great way to get help. Um, I, I would prefer that you don't ask questions in here in, in, in the getting help discussions um, unless you need to, uh, and, and that would usually apply. Like if I post a, uh, my answer to someone's question here and you still have a question maybe about that problem, you can reply and say, Hey, I don't understand what you did in two minutes into the video or something. And, and I can go into further detail or something like that. But typically, um, you know, show, I you, use the process that I showed you how to, um, ask questions. Um, and that will work. Uh, I, I really want to keep this uh, this forum uh, these forums well organized so other students can navigate through this and it can get really messy if a lot of students start posting here and the organiza organization isn't kind of maintained. So uh, let me know if you have any concerns. I'll be more than happy to help.